Hi Leo. Yo, January 2023. Tarot cards reading by M. Happy New Year to you. By the way, Leo's people out there. Anyway, four cards representing four weeks, the usual spread. Okay, so we have Eight of Cups, the High Priestess, Two of Cups, and Ten of Swords, Ten of Cups, beautiful Ten of Cups, your influencing energy. So Eight of Cups with the Empress, the High Priestess with a page of wands, two of cups with ace of wands, and a ten of swords with ace of cups. Oh, so sweet. Ten of cups, your influencing energy with a three of cups. Look at this a celebration. Beautiful energies influencing you here in January. Maybe it was just a beautiful festive season and you celebrated with your family, with your relatives, uh, children, parents, you see what I'm saying, all happy, all together. Perhaps that happiness lifts you up, okay? These strong emotions, this connectivity with other people, this love and support, feeling it all the time, perhaps very important for you in the January, being that you do have these two aces, page of wands, and you were, it seems to me, leaving something behind, you are beginning something new, you are traveling, you are leaving your parents' home, this happy home, okay, in order to, I don't know, start your own life. It was happy, it was lovely, but you were searching for something more for yourself, something which you can achieve just for yourself, just by yourself. You see what I'm saying? Lovely to have support of the family, but you want something just for yourself, to achieve it by yourself or in that sense. And it seems to me we were talking something about your future. The Empress always uh, talks about your plans, long-term plans, something which will be born later on and it will stay in your life, will be successful, will be magical in your life um, for next maybe 20, 30 years, maybe for the, the whole life. It's supposed to bring you happy, abundant life. The Empress is enjoying it. That's that what is on your mind. You're supposed to enjoy your life. You're supposed to be rich. You're supposed to be satisfied. Everything is just beautiful and lovely here. Love, abundance, um, everything is there with this energy. There where you are heading. That's what's on your mind. You see what I'm saying? With Eight of Cups, you are heading towards this love happiness abundance that what you want that what is all about and it seems to me it was i don't know opportunity perhaps a present for it even earlier on known that you will achieve it you will have it you know how in that sense perhaps this ten of cups three of cups this celebration might actually actually indicate your certainty about that where you are about that where you are heading certainty about your future about your loving abundant future you see what I'm saying? This first week is just about that. That what you want. There where you are heading. Beautiful. No, the high priestess out there, still secretive energy, still very passive energy, things still to reveal itself, okay, um, maybe reveal itself, it's not that is happening, you are still going towards, okay, in that sense, these first two weeks of January, still going towards that what you want, something you were expecting to know, okay, something to be revealed, something to be known, on, something to be said or um, understood. In that sense, this high priestess out there, it's always about knowledge, of always about something which will, as I said, reveal itself and soon. Um, no surprise here. You know what you are expecting. It will happen. This energy of page of wands is very enthusiastic. You know what you are expecting out of that what you are doing now, out of this idea which you are having in your mind. Very young, very youthful energy, but certain about where to from now on. You see what I'm saying? And being very excited about where to 
Again, this page of ones talks about it. No action, all right? No action yet. That what you are expecting doesn't happen yet here. It will happen uh, after something, I don't know, around you. This is outer energy. Something around you still to, I don't know, to show itself some knowledge, some understanding, something. But you are certain yourself. You are enthusiastic yourself. You are just waiting for this go ahead. All things are happening. Now I know. Now I have my license. Now I have approvals. You see what I'm saying? Perhaps you are waiting for something like that. Approvals, license, or things, some, administ some administrative things could also be that you are waiting for. But still, this second week of January says you are waiting for, but you are not uh, losing your um, enthusiasm. I mean, you are still happy. You know for sure it will. Sooner or later, you will have it. And then off to go with your life, with this career, with something exciting for yourself. There it is again in your hands. You are creating your new opportunity, your new opportunity for your new life. Okay, it's all the time is about it. You want a new life, abundant, happy, loving, something very prosperous for yourself. You are looking forward to, might be now, the third week of January that you have another one out there. Could now these two cups could mean uh, um, some sort of partnership. This is beautiful relationship in the making, and might be that we were talking the very same idea about your career, about your life, and now you were in partnership with another related to your career, to your business. Might be something like that, but they kind of feel, being that we have this Ace of Cups after, um, that is perhaps about your love life, particularly this time, this third week of January. This is very sexual, very passionate energy, Ace of Wands. Perhaps this relationship is just born, it's just beginning to happen and you are seeing exceptional opportunity you are seeing your soulmate you are seeing love of your life out there you see what I'm saying very excited about this pros about prospect for this relationship with this person could be something like that anyhow we do have excitement surely on your side about relationship with another. Now we can talk love, relationship, business, partnership or relationship with your siblings or so. Doesn't matter. But excitement, happiness, some something very prosperous, something committed, beautiful is beginning to form here and you are trusting it and you are loving it this third week of uh, January. Now last week with the Ten of Swords, it says, you've been worrying about something, okay, and that will fall away. Begi that will begin to fall away. Still visible here, okay, this kind of defeat, some something when, you know, kind of life defeated you, or some sort of situation that you couldn't fight, um, you were just unable to go against, or in that sense, that sort of situation. You see what I'm saying? This person is a down, bottom down, okay, something you couldn't fight, you could couldn't go against, whether that we talk people or situation or something, okay, defeated you here, um, maybe you were single, alone for a very long time, that is perhaps going away, maybe you did have lots of worries related to your life in general, now that goes away, I really believe you felt, even, even maybe by the end of last year, you felt that things are getting better, things will, things will change and soon, you expected that things will change and soon, and perhaps now, by the end of January, things are for sure changing and soon. Ace of Cups, Ace of Wands, Ace of Cups, beautiful, beautiful opportunities you are creating yourself, you Leo, you new self, your new life beginning now. That what you wanted, that, as I said, let me go again, love, prosperity, abundance, satisfaction, okay? Now you are seeing possibility, you are creating, in fact, you are creating it for yourself, maybe with another, okay? But anyhow, it will take many worries that you did have earlier, um, some troubles, something, whatever that was difficult in your life, maybe just accumulated difficulties with the time, it will go away. 
time being that now you were in love your career will blossom your long-term plans for your life will become alive you see what I'm saying this uh, says that new brighter days are coming you see what I'm saying your plans for your future and new brighter days are coming in that sense beginning and the end of the month just in a different way this one with optimism about future and this one understanding what is going away difficulties are going away these worries are going away this type of life will go away something better something brighter is on its way you were expecting much happier much more prosperous much more loving and passionate times in your life from now on beautiful very optimistic very lovely leo enjoy it